In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to use Flexi Gel in your hair wash routine. I use this pre-conditioning rinse twice a month to increase hair growth and for smoothing out my hair. So if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like it and let's begin! I'm gonna start my Flexi Gel wash day by taking some time to prepare the gel before washing my hair. So what we're gonna do is to heat 4 cups of water in a pot. Once the water is boiling, carefully proceed to add 8 tablespoons of flax seeds in the boiling water. You can use brown or golden flax seeds, it doesn't matter as long as you're using whole organic flax seeds, it's all good. And to make this hair treatment incredibly beneficial for hair growth and hair loss, I'm gonna add one tablespoon of organic dry rosemary leaves to the pot in this way. And now in medium heat, all we're gonna do is to constantly stir the mixture until the gel forms. You'll notice when the gel has formed because there will be like a slimy consistency dripping from the spoon as you can see and that is a good indicator that our gel is ready to cool off. Once the mixture has cooled off, we're gonna extract extract the gel from the seeds by simply using a cheesecloth in this way. When you strain, do this in small amounts to avoid seeds mixing in the gel. By the way, when I was waiting for the gel to get cold, I used this time to prep my hair before shower, which is what I normally do. So I detangle my hair from ends to roots with this wooden comb. And I also applied a few drops of avocado oil to my scalp and hair to maximize the hydration. And now I am going to hop in the shower, set the temperature to look in warm water, and now just let my hair to soak in for one minute before shampooing. Like I said before, I use this flaxseed gel as a pre-conditioning hair rinse, so before applying the gel, we gotta shampoo the scalp very well for about three minutes in this way, so that there is no oil, dirt, or buildup on the hair when we apply this treatment. By the way, in this wash day, I'm using Leave In Proof Full Shampoo, which supposed to add body and volume to the hair. Next, I'm going to rinse the shampoo with warm water and now that my hair is super clean and ready to absorb anything I put on, Here's how we do the Flexi Gel hair mask in the shower. So we're gonna begin by removing the excess water out of the hair with a microfiber towel. The goal in here is to get rid of a good amount of water so that the hair shaft has an easier time to soak in the properties of the gel without having the barrier from the water. I hope this makes sense. Now all we're gonna do is to scoop with our hands a small amount of the flaxseed gel and then slowly spread the gel from the roots towards the ends of your hair in this way. To make application more simple, make sure to massage the gel in every application in a downward motion so that in this way you don't cause tingles or raise up the cuticle which can cause you frizz and we don't want that, right? By the way, with this particular gel, you don't need to worry about slippery surfaces, this is more sticky than and slippery so the only thing is to take your time to massage the gel very well so that it goes all over your hair and in your scalp because if you don't do this it will only sit on the outer layers of your hair i've been using flaxseed in my wash routine for a while and all i can say is that this is one of the best ways to use this gel if you want to maximize its benefits like in one wash i can see how well it restores my fine hair into a more strong fuller one this gel also fits the scalp with vitamin E which is crucial for healthy hair growth and I also experienced less shedding during the week when I used this specific mixture of flaxseed and rosemary. At this point my hair and scalp is basically covered in this gel so what we're gonna do next is to wrap the hair with a warm microfiber towel so just soak one of these in super hot water squeeze the water and right away cover your hair with this for 15 minutes the reason we do this is to help the gel to actually penetrate deeper into the hair because the heat opens up the cuticle and also the heat stimulates scalp circulation which ultimately will help us with hair growth during this wait time i'm gonna clean my body and exfoliate now the time is up, we're gonna rinse the gel with lukewarm water for about a minute, no more than that. Okay. 
and then it is extremely important to follow up with a salient so in this case you can use your regular conditioner or a hydrating hair mask it's up to you in my case I'm gonna apply a generous amount of Shea Moisture Manuka Honey Intense Hydration Mask from middle to the ends of my hair you know this hair mask for me has been a game changer even though it is not meant for my hair type it has done more than many other hair masks that are supposed to be for my hair type so advice of the day be open to trying new things you can be surprised after I let the hair mask on for five minutes I'm gonna proceed to do the final water rinse with cool water for 10 seconds to boost hydration in my hair now let's remove the excess water with a clean microfiber towel then cover for 15 minutes to allow the towel to absorb as much as moisture from the hair as possible Well, it's it's not a buy. It's more like see you in 15 minutes, okay? Yeah. For my after shower hair care routine, I'm going in with the Innet Life Live-In Conditioner to add more hydration and to seal the cuticle. I'm going in with Moroccan Oil Treatment, which is a lightweight, alcohol-free hair serum that I love so much and fully recommend. All right, guys. So I have finished applying all my Live-In products. My hair feels. Fabulous. I'm gonna let my hair air dry, which is gonna take for the rest of the day. I don't like the stress about I'll see you guys tomorrow, okay? All right, next side, this is how my hair looks. This has definitely enhanced smoothness and shine on my hair by two times. When I grab my fine hair, it feels more heavy, strong, and very healthy in general, which tells me that flaxseed does add a very tiny amount of protein to my hair. Might not be as extreme as rice water, but I can see it on my hair. So if your hair is extremely sensitive to protein, you might want to consider only using the flaxseed gel on your scalp once a week so that you can still get the amazing benefits of hair growth and reducing hair fall. Sick. <laughs> I am seriously trying to focus and looking at you right now, but that squirrel is just Oy. doing some acrobatics. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> I really hope you guys get to try this flexi shower routine. Love, 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 love the results. Try this out, let me know in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to share some love to me by subscribing to this channel right here. Thank you so much for watching and I hope I will get to see you in the next video. Pura vida. I feel like I was just trying to become that squirrel. Love you, bye.